basically if, if kids are interested and they understand the commitment because it, it, it's a big commitment marching band is just open to anyone we, we invite students anyone from ninth grade to twelfth grade and then middle school students will sit down and have conversations with them see what their level of interest is because obviously for a younger kid it, it can be a kind of a big time commitment marching band season the competitive season is in the fall it starts in late September goes all the way through October and it finalizes um, at our championship performance at MetLife Stadium at the first or second week in November. Like last, last year, I think we did 230 hours of practicing. Um, we start preparing for that long ahead of time to make sure that the conditioning aspect, that the, the technical development is where it needs to be in November. Mid-May, we start with our practices, and then we continue on uh, just twice a week, and then once we hit this week, it's always the same week in August, this is just understood as part of the, the, the season, it's part of our activity. Typical marching band season is starting off the year, learning your basic drill and stuff. Eventually you're going to learn up to the show and once you get to band camp, we're going to start perfecting it and then you go through the season. It's competition season. It's the best season there is. You have to love it to do it, but a lot of kids that are, are curious if they do love it by the end of the season, they, they can't wait for next season to start up. The week of band camp is one of the most difficult weeks a high schooler would go through in, in a school activity. You'll go through extreme heat, you'll go through eight hour rehearsals, an exhausting process. But within that, you're doing that same process with a with hundred other students who are working to the same thing. You end up creating bonds and friendships that last a, li a lifetime. I met my wife marching, I met my best friends marching, I marched with everybody in my wedding party. I get birthday cards from the Netherlands and Japan from friends I made around the planet. Um, and friends I could still talk to tomorrow as if I had just seen them yesterday because we've been through something like this. I remember it was hot, it was tiring, and I was sweating so much. But by the end of it, I had so much fun. I would definitely do band camp again. Band camp's very intimidating at first, but um, once you realize what it's all about, getting better and improving as a whole band, I think um, you really want to drive to uh, become better as a whole band. By the end of that, these kids really start feeling that they're part of more than just a marching band. They're part of a family and a, and a really, really big team. Not just through the like dinner time where kids get to hang out with each other, but it happens just these reps that they do. So like right now, over on these fields, when kids are going from one uh, rehearsal to it and then they repeat it, they the talking that happens in between, that's where the real magic happens that helps us go into the next phase of our season, which is competitions. Band camp is Monday through Friday, 12 to 8. It is where we do the bulk of our work. It is where we move from not really knowing anything about what we do to making a world championship performance. And it's split up between uh, smaller group work and, and full ensemble work. We have to split up the day to address the three different aspects, visual, uh, general effect, and music. So right now we have our color guard on one field, we have our percussion on a different field, brass and woodwinds on a different field. We start the day with a visual program where we work on how we work on our feet and where we're going. Middle of the day we work on our music, how we play it, and at the end of the day we have our hour for dinner and the last two hours every night we put everyone together and we really start building the pieces of our, of our competitive show. Um, everybody on the field, what it's going to look like. Sometimes in uniform. It's a 48 hour uh, time intensive, uh, sometimes a little bit sweaty, a little couple tears here and there, a uh, chance to, to work together and to get to know the staff, get to know the kids. Yeah, it's a little excruciating at times, but you know what? They give you ice pops, so it's all cool later. Danny, I'm tired. Great. Tired. It's gone, guys. It's, it's going to be worth it all in the end. Yeah, it's definitely fun. It's a good experience. Like, you make friends. Because it's like fun. You get to like meet new people from your school and like you get to go to different places. Apple healthy <laughs> um, We work really hard and then it pays off at the end. Get to hang out with friends. Oh, I can't yeah, lie. yeah, you guys. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. Good stuff. When kids join, they don't really understand what this is. They don't understand what it is to be on a competitive team like this. More, most importantly, they don't understand that marching band is not just uh, let's march down the street in a parade. It's an actual complete field show where you're competing against other teams. So it kind of co combines band, which is something you usually don't consider to be competitive, with this hugely competitive atmosphere. You know, some of our shows, we've got 2,000 people watching us and cheering for us. Uh, that's really what, what really gets these kids going. The spotlight's on you. You perform your best. You're along with your band family, it's probably the best thing that has to happen. So that's what uh, marching band is 
for BMR. It's not like that at every school, and we're lucky that we have that culture here at BMR. The bus rides, the shows, hanging out with friends, you know, the, like I said, the family that we create. Travel is one of the best parts, uh, especially when you have some good close friends. I, I tell the middle school parents of kids that join, you know, not only do your kids get to have these role models that are juniors and seniors in high school, but when they get to that transition where they go from eighth grade to ninth grade, they're entering ninth grade and they already know almost a quarter of the kids at the school. If you join and don't have close friends, then uh, you'll definitely make some. Especially if you're an incoming freshman, this is your chance to make a lot of new friends and to be with people and have a great time. I would say 95% of the kids that sign up, no matter what level of apprehension they have, actually will make it through the entire season. Uh, you should join because marching band is the best activity BMR has to offer. It is fun, you meet new people, you play great music, and all at the same time you put together a production that you'll remember for the rest of your life.